Hey, here we are in the best handyman in the world's workshop. <laughs> and that's pretty funny. But we have our tent and we've taken a lot of stuff off of it. We just, uh, we, uh, it's our rooftop tent. And so you can see inside the mattress is out right now um, so that we can work on things, make things a little bit easier. We are going to put the, um, the ladder on. That's uh, these two. They're gonna come right in here, which means that I need to get inside the channel and uh, put, the, put the bolts through so that I can screw, uh, uh, you know, put, put, the, uh, put the nuts on. And then this will go on like that. And then we'll be able to flip this down and use the ladder to get in. The next thing that we're gonna do is that we're gonna put these on underneath. But to do that, we're gonna lift this up so we can get to the underside. And then when it's up, we'll drive the, uh, drive the truck in put the tent on it and from that point in time we can start putting uh, the rain fly back on put the mattress back in we're gonna take it out open the whole thing up uh, just make sure everything's working right yep. okay all right so watch us as we uh, as we have a lot of fun by the way all of this stuff came all of this came uh, nice in here. We printed out the uh, the instructions. Now we've got one of these walkabouts yep. uh, with the 72, right? So lots of stuff up here, including the cover. So as you can see, we've got this uh, everything kind of open in there without the uh, without the mattress. So this is the front. And we just put the, uh, the brackets in. Uh, they have them taped on both sides. And so two there, two there, and uh, right there. Same thing on the bottom. Now that we flip that back up, you can see we've got these really good and tight now. So that flip back this way. And now we're gonna put, the, uh, put the, that ladder on. We put washer, ladder, plastic washer, attachment, washer, and then bolt on both sides. And we put this so that we can read all of the instructions when we're completely out. And then we have quick access to undo that. And then there's some, uh, as you can see these uh, pads kind of go sit right on that. Okay, time to tighten them up and test them. All right, there we go. And you're like, yeah, that looks upside down. It is. Don't worry about it, we'll show you outside, okay? All right, bringing her down. Okay, all right, so now see, we've got our, all of this nice and free and clear now, okay? And what we do is that these go right in there. So we're gonna have one, two, three, four, and we, we ordered these special locking nuts. Let's take a look at those. 
everything. And we can see we've got a special wrench that goes on in there and it's the only thing that can really turn those, especially once you get them really tight. So we'll tighten those up with, with that. So let's put two on that far front. You can do that. I'll put the other two on. We've got them in and we've got it under now. The HD bar is basically, now I know this isn't my HD bar, but just work with me here. Okay, it's gonna go like that, you know, across and on both sides, then we'll tighten it up on that HD bar, right? So we're gonna take this off. We're gonna lift this up just a little bit more and then we're gonna bring the truck in and we'll put these over the HD bar and we'll make sure that everything is nice and where it should be. Yeah, this is gonna be, this is the hinge end. And so we want this to hinge out over the, uh, the passenger side. So when we bring the truck in, this will be on the correct side and then we can just uh, lock those up. Now, these are the locking ones. So we're gonna lock them on both sides on this front rail. And so if it, somebody wants to, I suppose they can take the back off, but they can't get the front off, so they can't get, they can't get the uh, rooftop tent. So goes the theory. Well, let's see if it works. And, uh, you know, they give us some wrenches, but uh, I'm sorry. I'm using the socket for this. Get it all nice. Now, I'm not going to make it super tight yet, because I got the other three to do. And, uh, but, uh like to make them all nice and even, but we're trying to get this as uh, centered uh, uh, on the vehicle as possible. Now, unfortunately, that's our satellite. And so I think that our satellite kind of goes away, unless we wanted to move this forward, but we're just, just don't think that we want to move it forward too much more on that. So that's something we'll have to ponder uh, as far as usability uh, with everything. So I kind of like it right there. Can, can we open up the back, the back hatch? All right, so see that was really our biggest concern is making sure that that hatch can open. We're gonna go uh, for test drive. Now the mattress is still in and we didn't uh, put in any of this stuff and the rain fly isn't on yet. The whole goal was to get it on. We're gonna take it out. We're gonna get a bite to eat. So this is gonna go out and uh, we're gonna see how well it does on a dry run. All right, here we go. All right, so we're putting the rain fly on. We think now normally I think this will come off and we'll undo it and put it underneath. And then of course we got bars to come on out here. A little on the windy side, so we'll see if we do that. Well here we are in our handy dandy tent. And we're not level or anything right now, but uh, we're gonna put some lights in here. We can see out. Now we've got a moon roof here, a moon roof here, and another whole entryway over on this side right here. All right, not necessarily the prettiest first time, but we're gonna take it out. We got it all on. Looks like we need to do some work on the ladder area. But, uh, yeah, cause it's just, it's just real thick on this side. Well, we made it. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? We have the rooftop tent.